Your question is, what made up place from a book or movie would you like to visit and why? Well, if I could visit a made up place from a book, then it would probably be Candyland. It's in this, well, it's not really Candyland, but it's like the, the character in the book, she's thinking about candy and, and like she's really imaginative. And, and so I want to be in the candy tooth fairy world that she made up. And the book is called Dory Phantasmagory. I, I would like to be in it because like the trees, they're made out of lollipops. And there's like, it's really cool. The clouds are made out of cotton candy. It's so cool. And then, and then she walks to this um, castle and it's the Tooth Fairy castle and then she finds out that the Tooth Fairy is actually her enemy and it's and it's a really cool place and there are, I like to read books a lot so there's a lot of other places that I would like to be in that was from a book that's like fantasy not real because books they, they can like be anywhere they can be in Palm Springs they can be in Unicorn Land so it's really yeah, I think that's really cool. And then in, some, in the one book I was talking about earlier, in Dory Phantasmagory, she she is really funny, and I think you should read that book too. And another world I would probably like to be in that was in a book would probably be Atlantis. And it's in this book called Keeper of Lost Cities, and it's really cool because there's like a bunch of stores and in that world, they sell a thing, and it's called, like, they sell good stuff in that world, and it's really cool, and they have, like, s cool stones, like, there's some stones called star stones, and, yeah, I, that's one, that's another world that I would like to visit. Thank you. Contestant number one is eligible. Thank you, contestant one. If you'd like to stay and watch, please mute yourself and turn off your camera. Otherwise, you're free to leave the meeting. All righty, contestant number two, would you check that you are unmuted and that you can see the timekeeper and then get into your position to answer your question? Give me a thumbs up when you're ready for the question. Okay. What made up place from a book or movie would you like to visit and why? Um, I would visit Hogwarts because it's kind of like a school, but one thing I don't like about it is that it's boarding school, so I kind of wouldn't want to go there. And I would like to go to other places, but those are not. So I can't really think of ones which are not made up, which are made up. The only one which I can think of is Hogwarts, so I would go there because it's based off of well, it is a book um, called Harry Potter, and they made movies of it. So I would go there. Also, I might go to it. Star Wars planet, but that would be kind of quick because there's a lot of fighting, but um, I would go to other places, but I don't really know. So I would try to find more places or make up places in my mind. 
and I might want to go there, like a place I made up in my mind was like this weird place with everything candy. Thank you. Okay, if you'd like to stay, please mute yourself and turn off your video. Otherwise, you're free to head out. We'll bring in contestant number three. Contestant number two is eligible, by the way. All righty, contestant number three. Ready? Uh, please make sure you are unmuted. Make sure you can see the timekeeper, Cullen. And then when you are in the position and ready for your question, please give me a thumbs up. Wonderful. All righty, your question is, hold on, let me find it here. All righty, your question is, what made up place from a book or movie would you like to visit and why? So if I could be in a made up place that's in a book, I might wanna be in probably my my favorite book, James and the Giant Peach, because I really like peaches and I would like to experience having a really, really big peach and then I could eat it all. Not only that, but they also have a chocolate factory book that I haven't read yet, but I know it's a book. So I want to see what the chocolate factory is like. So I, I could try out their chocolate and if it's good, then I, I might buy all the chocolate they have. What I really like about peaches is they're really juicy and they're sweet. And I really like fruit. Also, they have their friends, like a grasshopper, a spider, centipede, silkworm. I want to experience having some bug friends that are giant, about the size as me. And I think the funniest character is probably the centipede because he... He read a poem that he ate a bunch of weird things. I don't know any other books that that the same that that the same author wrote, but I really like experiencing experiencing a giant peach, a chocolate factory, and bug friends. Thank you. All righty, thank you. If you'd like to stay and watch the other contestants, please turn your camera off and mute yourself. Otherwise, you're free to leave the contest. Contestant number three is eligible. All righty, contestant number four, would you please unmute yourself. Make sure that you can see the timekeeper, Cullen, and get in position to receive your question. Are you ready for your question? Yes. All righty. The question is, what made up place from a book or movie would you like to visit and why? A made up place from a book or movie that I'd like to visit is Arendelle. Arendelle, it's like a really nice soft area and frozen, and frozen too. And all lots of snow falls there. Sometimes it's warm, sometimes it's cold. And I like places like that. Because they're not always too cold or hot. Arendelle can be pretty cold in the winter, but not as hot over here in the summer. 
And also, it'd be pretty cool to live in Arendelle because there's a castle there. And I've, I've never seen a people living in a castle or visiting a castle in real life. Going to castles is really cool because like it's a huge like a mansion. And also, if I was elected queen or something, that be like I get to live in the class castle, and that's really more fun. Arendelle, it's like. A, a place where everyone works together because if you watch something's never changed like in the movie Frozen 2 like they like they're all working together to do stuff and like celebrating this thing I don't know what it's called or something but they're celebrating something and like they're all working together and it'd be really nice to work together because then works will get more fa more done faster for like you have to work together to build a whole house and also Arendelle I love snow so much and snowing it's just like really fun to play in and it's just one of the best things there's all other cool things to do and Arendelle is something that I really would like to go to thank you all right. Contestant number four is eligible. Thank you. If you'd like to stay and watch, please mute yourself and turn off your camera. Otherwise, you're free to leave the contest. All righty, to our next contestant, if you would please unmute yourself. Make sure you can see the timekeeper, Cullen, and get in position to receive your topic, your question. Are you ready for your question? All right, it is. What made up place from a book or movie would you like to visit and why? If I were to go to a made up place, that would be going to Ryan the Last Dragon. That's my favorite movie. If I were to make a made up place, I would go to Candyland. And that's always in my dreams. Trees would be lollipops and uh, rivers would be melted chocolate. It's so cool there. But the bad thing about going there is that, well, if you slip into the chocolate river, you go to a different world, more spookier, more ghosty. So, I don't like that world, so I try to be very careful when crossing it. But sometimes I end up going there, and I have to go through an obstacle course. And this guy is competing against me, bigger, stronger, faster. He's been through this obstacle course many times. And so the first obstacle would be going through lasers. So there would be a lot of lasers and you would have to make it to the other side without getting burnt. The next would be surviving this zoo where animals escape from their cages and start chasing you all the way to the other end. Believe me, I got scared to death and I did not like that part. That's my least favorite place. Then, you go through this place where it's booby trapped. So if you touch something, a certain thing, like maybe you touch the flower vase, and then all of a sudden a booby trap will come and fall on you. Wow, that's scary. So sometimes I don't make it and sometimes I do. So that would be the place where I would want to be. Thank you. Contestant number five is eligible. All righty, contestant number five, if you'd like to stay and watch, please turn off your camera, make sure you stay muted. Otherwise you're free to head out from the contest. We've now brought in contestant number six. 
And contestant number six, would you make sure that you are unmuted? All righty, make sure you can see the timekeeper on your screen and then get in position uh, for, to receive your question. Are you ready for your question? Yeah. All right, your question is, what made up place from a book or movie would you like to visit and why? I would. I would like to visit very beautiful and it has many um it has many places to go like unicorn land fairy land and then they're all i uh in this book rainbow magic there's always like these new fairies that i discovered like uh i don't know but there's like a valentine fairy there's like an owl fairy and then there's these other type of stuff like Special edition, which is my favorite type of ones, because it's really cool. And there's like these ice castles and those things. And then, um, um, then I like to, uh, I like the rainbow magic thing because it's really, I really love the magic that they do, and it's really fun. And actually, when I read it, it feels so good that I want to read more books, and then I get books and books and books, and I read it for every single time when I go to the library, and I discover a lot of new things. And and then um, I like the and then another book that I really want to visit is that the I like this place for deer dragons and there's like an ice mm -hmm. there's an ice place there's a mud place and the story is really nice and it gives me a lot of like um, attention to that book and then I get more and more stuff to read about thanks Contestant number six is eligible. Thank you. Contestant six, if you'd like to stay and watch, make sure you are muted and your camera is off. Otherwise, you're free to leave the contest. We'll be announcing the winners at four o'clock central and two o'clock Pacific. All right, waiting for number seven to sign in. Number seven, turn your camera on. There we go. All right. If you could make sure you're unmuted and get in posi standing position for the answer and also make sure that you can see the timekeeper, that would be great. Give me a thumbs up when you're ready for your question. All right. Your question is, what made up place from a book or movie would you like to visit and why? I would like to visit Hogwarts, number one, because that is the school of witchcraft and wizardry in Harry Potter. There's movies and books. Did you know there's actually eight book, um, eight movies and seven books? The seventh book is so long, they had to split it up into two movies. I would rather go i'd go to hogwarts so that i can def defend myself against voldemort he's the bad guy in harry potter another book i would probably want to go into is um actually the i will i would like to go into the first book of harry potter and so I can probably I can meet Hermione when she's like around my age. I'm actually gonna be able to go in Hogwarts this year. So I hope I get Ravenclaw. 
My favorite house is Ravenclaw because they're sharp and they they're they they're blue and I love blue. And then if I'm not in Ravenclaw, I would be in Gryffindor. So another book I'm another movie I'd like to be in is the new My Little Pony movie because they are Pegasi and different types of ponies with magic. Thank you. Contestant number seven is eligible. Thank you. Contestant number seven, if you keep your video uh, camera off and muted, you can stay and watch the remaining contestants. Otherwise, you're free to head out. We'll now bring in contestant number nine. All right, contestant number nine, make sure you are unmuted. Make sure you can see the timekeeper, Cullen, and get in position to receive your topic. When you're ready for your topic, give me a thumbs up. <clears throat> All righty, your question is, what made up place from a book or movie would you like to visit and why? I would like it very much if I could go to a made up place from a book or movie. I have this one book that I really like and it's called The Phantom Tollbooth. It's about a person who goes into a toll booth and sees a whole bunch of cool things. One of the places from there I would like to go to is called The Forest of Sight. It teaches you a lot of different things and when you're inside of it, it can be really, really fun. It is very interesting to go there because you get to learn a lot of things. <coughs> the boy who was originally there in the book was, was very bored for his whole life and he was really excited when he got back. But unfortunately, he couldn't go into the Phantom Toll Booth again. I want to be able to go in it as many times as I can. The Phantom Toll Booth will be a really, really fun thing to go in. Also, because there are many different challenges, such as rescuing Lime and Weasel and two princesses and making sure that you do not accidentally go off into the doll drums, which is another place mentioned in the book. I would really hate it if I was able to go to the doll drums, but I would definitely make friends with a lot of people there. It would be a very interesting place to go. Another reason why I would like to go to the Phantom Toll Booth is because the Phantom Toll Booth is so big and most of the challenges but there are some other places that I would like to go to too that are mentioned in a book or movie such as islands. There's one island I forget the name of in a book called My Father's Dragon that I really like, but it would not be as fun. Thank you. Contestant number nine is eligible. All righty, contestant number nine, if you'd like to watch the final contestant, you are free to mute yourself and turn off your camera. Otherwise, you free, feel free to leave the contest room. All right, just waiting for the next contestant to arrive. There she is. All righty. Would you make sure that you are muted, contestant number, unmuted, contestant number 11? And make sure you can see the timekeeper, Cullen. And also, are you, uh, when you are, how you would like to be positioned on the screen, give me a thumbs up when you're ready for your question. All righty, your question is, what made up place from a book or movie would you like to visit and why?
Please begin your answer. One place I read about in a book, well, a book called Sophia's Journal, which is right now in that shelf, is um, Kansas in 1857. Well, it's actually a Sophia's journal is actually a book that I received um one time and it's not a real book. It's a time travel story and isn't real where um, there's a time travel river and when someone falls into the river, well, it says that we were going to Lawrence and I fell in that river. And I think it's a train travel because I got washed away to 1857. Thank you. Contestant number 11 is eligible. All righty. Thank you, everyone. That concludes our Junior Speakers League Impromptu Contest.